The Bible says in 1 Timothy 5 and 22, and Paul's talking about ordination and setting men in position, and he tells Timothy this in 1 Timothy 5 and 22, says, Lay hands suddenly on no man, neither be partaker of other men's sins, keep thyself pure. This is also confirmed by Paul whenever he says in 1 Thessalonians 5 and 12, And we beseech you, brethren, to know them which labor among you and are over you in the Lord and admonish you. Now Paul's telling us saying, make sure you know who it is you ordain. Don't just hand out a license to everybody that sends in an application through the mail. Come on. Amen. Don't just hand them out. Make sure you know the person. Make sure you know that they're born again. Make sure you know that they are called of the Lord. And knowing as we do that Brother Mike is called of the Lord to preach and we have witnessed the gifts of the Spirit working through him, I want to give him the same charge tonight that Paul gave to Timothy in 1 Timothy 4 and 12. He said, Let no man despise thy youth, but be thou an example of the believers in word, in conversation, in charity, in spirit, in faith, in purity. Brother Mike read that scripture tonight. In verse 14, he says, Neglect not the gift that is in thee, which was given thee by prophecy, with the laying on of the hands of the presbytery. Meditate upon these things. Give thyself wholly to them, that thy profiting may appear to all. Take heed unto thyself and unto the doctrine. Continue in them, for in doing this thou shalt both save thyself and them that hear thee. Paul's telling Timothy this thing is more than just a hobby. Yeah. This is a dedication. This is a lifestyle. This is a commitment. Hallelujah. Paul goes on to tell Timothy in 2 Timothy 4 and 1, and I like this. Come on. And these words, not just for Brother Mike tonight, but for all of us. I charge thee therefore before God and the Lord Jesus Christ, who shall judge the quick and the dead at his appearing and in his kingdom. Amen. Brother Mike, preach the word. Be instant in season, out of season. Reprove, rebuke, exhort with all long suffering and doctrine. For the time will come. Now he's warning Timothy of this, and Brother Mike has already experienced some of this, as we all know is taking place today. For the time will come when they will not endure sound doctrine, but after their own lust shall they heap to themselves teachers having itching ears. They shall turn away their ears from the truth, and shall be turned into fables. But watch thou in all things, endure afflictions, do the work of, of an evangelist, and make full proof of your ministry. And that's the charge that I give to Brother Mike tonight. No doubt he's already felt in the Spirit. But if you'll come up here and stand before the church tonight, I want as many of us that will to come up and lay hands on Brother Mike and we're going to dedicate him afresh and anew. And by the authority, by the authority that has been given to this church through our Lord Jesus Christ, we're going to confirm and be a witness to what God has already done in His life and ask for a fresh anointing that Brother Mike will go forth in the Gospel ministry and preach the Gospel like never before and that the gifts of the Spirit will work through Him like never before. Thank you, Jesus. Father, right now in the name of Jesus, Lord, we confirm what You have already done through Brother Mike. And God, we just ask You right now, Lord, Oh God, that you would put a fresh anointing, Lord, a double portion upon him. Lord, we ordain him right now in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Lord, as a vessel, Lord, for you to use in whatever ministry, Lord, that you would take him down. Whatever word, whatever road, Lord, that you would lead him to share your word, Lord, that you would move and be with him in whatever he does. In the name of Jesus, yes. we charge him, yes. according to the word of God, that he would preach the word, do the work of an evangelist, and make full proof of his ministry. In Jesus' name, in the name of Jesus, Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. <clears throat> and we got Brother Mice. License. Thank you, brother. And he can put that in his wallet. Amen. Hallelujah. Give the Lord a hand tonight for Brother Mike. Amen. Amen. Now this doesn't make Brother Mike more of a preacher. Oh. All this does is just confirm. What God has done through him, and that God's going to continue to work through him. Amen. Hallelujah.
Amen. Love you, brother.